So I know in the last video I said that the Santa Claus hat would be with me throughout the 12 days of anime. Yeah, I kind of fucked up in my department and left it in my college. I know you can all boo me. At yes, yes, I can hear all the boos. Okay, calm down. Uh, I plan on getting it back, but for right now, as alternate replacement... No? It doesn't feel right. Fucking knew it. Anyway! <laughs> Hello, once more people of YouTube, tis I once more, the Crimson Assassin, and welcome to the 12 days of anime. Sadly, with no Christmas hat. One like equals one rip. Anyway, so today people of YouTube, we're going to talk about day one of the 12 days of anime. And my people of YouTube, this 12 days of anime is going to be like no other. So without any further ado, when with me adjusting my shitty camera, let's begin the 12 days of anime. So, who has the honor of being my day one pick for the best anime moment of 2017? Well, that honor goes to My Hero Academia Season 2. And a certain moment in My Hero Academia Season 2 really, 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 really resonated with me, gave me goosebumps, and really showcased the levity and the overall just thinking of a certain madman, and that madman is the hero killer Stain and his philosophy of what it means to be a true hero. People of YouTube, Stain's philosophy of what it is to be a true hero basically sums up like this. Okay, you have a special power and you're using it for your own selfish gain regardless of you doing good with that said power? Okay, you're fake, you're not a hero, so you must die. That's basically what it is. and. And that's what, that's what it is in essence, but when you really come down to really thinking about what this philosophy and what this line of thinking really means, it really gets you thinking, like, damn, this character is pretty messed up. So what puts this moment on this list? Well, like I said, I mean, it just gives me goosebumps throughout route, but it really gets you thinking, yeah, really, if you truly think about it, you know, I think the meaning of the word hero is lost in My Hero Academia. It truly, it truly showcases that in the, in the franchise because 80% of the population has a quirk, has its own unique, special, unique power and catered to his, uh, his or herself. And with all these superhuman uh, uh, people, you know, the term hero kind of gets lost because hero is not necessarily a thing that you would do in a normal comic book, it's actually an occupation. You can actually earn money and become famous by being a hero. And pretty much that's what a majority of the people who are now a hero, what does? Uraraka is a pure example because the reason why she becomes wants to become a hero is because, well, she wants to make money to just support her family. Well, in the eyes of Stain, that, he sees that as a very selfish gain and really should not be something that should be rewarded. So he follows the idealist uh, footsteps of All Might because All Might is that symbol of hope. He actually, you know, rescues people because he just likes rescuing people. And he looks up to All Might and literally said it himself, the only person I would want to me to die by in the hands of is All Might. And it truly showcases the overall insanity that is Stain, but he also gets you really truly thinking about the concept of being a hero. And of course, there's a lot of stipulations, a lot of things that can go wrong with becoming a hero, and Stain truly showcases that in his ideals, in his philosophy. Now, you know, in, in best typical fashion, you know, it just because you are, you know, you're right doesn't mean you're cor uh, doesn't mean you're correct doesn't mean that you're right. He is right, but at the same time, you don't you can choose not to follow his ideals, and that ultimately. Is what puts this moment, his philosophy, on the best moments of the 12 days of anime. For me, at least, it's solid, it's great, and oh my god. If you want to hear a better discussion 
of the of the of the hero killer's philosophy, check out a video that me and Rising Sun did it in his channel where we taught when I was a part of his uh, you know, the 12 things he loves about My Hero Academia, and this is the discuss this, this is the exact discussion we just talked about. Funny enough, I'm wearing this shirt as I am talking about that moment, so it's kind of funny, it's just I'm wearing a thermal underneath. Um, and so yeah, people, that concludes day one of the 12 days of anime. Hope you guys really enjoyed, and I will see you in tomorrow with a new video. And with, sadly without my hat. Peace, YouTube!